Hello everybody, my name is Braxton and this is Agent 06. So this is a horror game that's based off of the 007 GoldenEye Nintendo 64 game. But before I get started with this, I just wanted to do a quick, huge shout out to me compadre, my good friend Lauren. Car crash, mother was driving. I assume your mom was driving. What? Why are you assuming your mom was driving? Just because of the, um, the medication, I think that it said like drowsiness and stuff too, so she might have fallen asleep at the wheel after taking medication for any persons. I think you think just because she's a woman, she can't drive. No, I'm not thinking that at all, Braxton, you sexist motherfucker. Not sexist, you're sexist. I'm calling you out. Uh huh. You do that. I always wonder what the SS on your jacket stood for. Yeah, super sexist. No. <laughs> <laughs> Because he is actually officially engaged with his, what used to be his girlfriend, Alicia. So congratulations to you both on the engagement. And I can't wait to be in the wedding. Also, one other thing that I haven't done the last couple of videos that I should have. In my Morris video, I made this bold claim. Here's another reference, I'm sure. Nobody else on this channel will get. If you know what I'm referencing with Bib Booty and Boot Biggie. Go ahead and put it in the comments. I am calling that nobody on here watching this video is going to know what the hell I'm even referencing. Which then get a comment from my brother, not that that's cheating or anything, <laughs> who confirmed that the quote that I was, what I was referring to was from my videos, Always Sometimes Monsters. Booty. Okay, big booty. Okay, my turn. Biggie. All right. <laughs> Yours truly, Big Booty and Boot Biggie. <laughs> now that's like a rap duo if I've ever heard one. And so he said that he won and he wanted me to tell him what I'd do with him as an ice cream. Clean yourself up. Changes on the drawer. Let's finally jump into this. All right. I don't know. Oh, nobody's even paying attention to me. Am I even like a good guy? Are they bad guys? Oh, I got a new gun. Oh, I picked up a sniper rifle. All right, well, I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Oh, I got a knife. Ah. Uh. I am not an MLG pro. Okay. Yeah, my aim not super great. This should be more like the actual uh, 007 Goldeneye where it just kind of auto locks for you. Then I'd be really good. Oh shit. It's hitting this box. These hitboxes. <laughs> Music's pretty good, too. I'm surprised how good the music is. So, like I said, as far as I know, this is supposed to be a horror game, but I'm not exactly sure what about it's supposed to be horror-related. Alright, editor, I need you to uh, do me a solid here and make me look good. I need you to edit this so I can actually like look pretty decent at this game. Is this the action button? Alright, I think I'm getting better at this. Shit's getting all distorted. Enter hide out with action. Alright. 
Oh, I got an Uzi now. Picked up a boomer. Oh! It's not the kind of boomer I was thinking about. Unable to delete entity? I, I don't know if I should probably hold on to that. Seven corrupted files find unable to recover files. Oh, jeez. It's a cool gun, but you definitely burn through that ammo quick. Something tells me these explode and I might not want to be around them. Oh, not as bad as I thought. I'm saving that boomer until uh, a boss or something. So I feel like I'm going to need it. I'm going to want it. I think headshots still do a lot of damage, so if I could aim for the head, that seems like the far better route. guys move quick oh man this is a uh, big maze big maze yeah I was never really a huge fan of the 007 gold knight I mean that's a lie just like a lot of people I was a huge fan of it growing up when I was younger but as I got older <laughs> I realized the original 007 gold knight on Nintendo 64 Contrary to what a lot of people want to believe, it doesn't hold up so well today. It's not that good. For the time, great. You try picking it up and playing it now, and it's okay. <laughs> Alright, got some body armor. Also, so far, I mean, this game is pretty interesting. But one of the coolest things about the N64 version of the game was getting to do cool stuff like uh, all the cool gadgets, devices, and all the secret and extra missions, saving people, like blowing certain things up, getting to the helicopter. So far, this game, which is a fan-made game and it's free, so I'm not going to be too harsh on it, <laughs> doesn't have much of a variety. <laughs> this is a lot more like a modern-day FPS. Alrighty, I think I am getting lost. I think it is safe to say. Oh. I was wrong. Destroy all the silos. Why are they making noises like something evil is about to come out of them? Are these like containing something that I probably should let them keep containing? Door opened. Awesome. I don't remember which door it'd be, but I guess it's open now. Oh, that must be the door. Lo sé, a mom. Hmm. Trying to reset game. Level not loaded correctly. Trying to reset the game. Resetting game. What? Error. Resetting game.
I have no ammo. I got a knife. Okay. Oh, well, I still got this. I don't need ammo for this, buddy. I'll give you the old... Yeah. I see. So it's prison rules you want. I don't know if I should be checking stuff for ammo and what not. Hmm. Oh. Can I just give you the old... Yeah. No? Get down? Huh? Cut you down? No? How dare somebody push this button? I'm hearing some... Some shifting. Hey! Body armor. Try to get me now. I dare you. I keep hearing scissors. Oh, I got body armor. It's weird that it would give me that if there wasn't... Gonna be a fight of some sort. Oh, man. He's doing the jig. He's doing the jig. Oh, there we go. Ah, shit! What the fuck? That wasn't cool. Oh. <laughs> he just... Uh, crawling all around. Okay. <laughs> I just got bullets. You know what that means. Old snazzy snoo. You've seen how good my accuracy is, buddy. I'd reconsider. Thank you, editor, for making me look good this whole time. Hey. Ha ha ha! Look at that. Haters will say it's fake. Hey. Open right up for me, will ya? Don't you fucking zigzag on me. What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Come here. Give me a little snazzy snoo. What the hell are you doing, my guy? <laughs> Come here. Ow, fuck. <laughs> that was a, is, that so, uh, is that supposed to be, like, legitimately scary? Yeah. No boomer this time? Do I have a boomer? Oh, I don't got a boomer. I should have used the boomer when I had the chance. Yeah, you better run. Destroy other friend. Oh, shit. Assuming those are what I'm supposed to be destroying. Oh, come on. I got him. I got him. More body armor. Which you could always use. I can't see anything. Oh. I think that was the point. Man, all these guys got fried before they could even get out of bed. Do I keep blinking or something going on? Can I walk by without you giving me the old swishy swoop? Alright. Cool. <laughs> okay. I don't know. It's like just this mixture of like horror and it's just so ridiculous at the same time. Door open. Picked up some ammo. Jeez, I'm... I should probably start zooming in, but I just feel like where he sways around, it's better to just kind of spray and pray. So this is where I want to go. This is where it glitched out on me before, and it wouldn't let me go any further. Blood trail leading down there. Is that where I want to go? Door requires a key card. Okay. So now I should be able to get the key card. Let's find it. There's a... Well, no. Ow! That wasn't fair. Nothing fair about that one at all. <laughs> Did 
This doesn't look quite as familiar. Aha! Look at that, it does work better. Buddy. Every time I look away, or... Is this merely a coincidence? Oh. Well? I guess I made it. Mission accomplished. Thank you for playing. Nuh-uh. That was the whole thing. Okay. So yeah, I guess that was the whole game. Not horrible for it being free and uh, indie made. But yeah, I thought there'd be a little bit more to that ending. Either way, that was actually a pretty interesting game. Let me know what you guys thought about it down in the comments below. I'll be looking forward to your answers. Yeah, like I said, I kind of just wish that there was a little bit more variety to it, but you can't complain as much when it comes to a small... I don't know how many people worked on this. Yeah, so I mean, it was made by one person, and it's definitely an interesting concept. So, hey, I can't complain about that. Like I said, let me know what you guys thought down in the bottom below. I'm interested to know. And as always, I'll see you guys in that next video. So have a good one. I'll see you there. Goodbye!